Did Gorilla Tag just leak the next secret update? And if they did, what is the next secret update? Well, in today's video, I will be telling you all the info that you missed and a little bit extra. So I say we get right into it. Also, if you're ever wondering what a good code to join a pool is, then just go into this code right here. It's my fan code. And there's always lots of cool people to play with. There's always a new new thing to do in there. So, so I mean, if you didn't hear the news or you haven't hopped on the game, Gorilla Tag added a lot, including this weird mouth moving mechanic that only works if you join a public or private room. Also, your eyes blink at certain decibel rates. As you can see, they start to close once I start getting louder or make different weird noises out of the blue. So yeah. Gorilla Tag released a new map for creators that rotates every couple weeks with a new map because Gorilla Tag is testing out new developers to see if they'd be worthy of creating updates for the game because I'm assuming they're trying to make bigger updates meaning they need more people and the best way to test them is by making them create maps. So as you can see right here is the science experiment update. They have not removed any of the science experiment update stuff yet like everything is still here including the mad scientist pack that is $30, uh, all these cosmetics and the science map. Also the winter flashback is finally here after many many videos and many many days of anticipation and waiting. And and it is on the second floor up there with a total of five signs directing you where to go. That's one, that's two, that's three, four is in there, and five is up there. We're gonna follow these ones though. Also, save your special shine rocks because if you don't, you're gonna be in trouble. I'm not joking, like you need these things. As you can see, here's the flashback sign. You come up here. I'm going fast because I need to speed run this. And as you can see, there's so many cosmetics this year. I mean, just look at it. I don't know what I'm gonna get yet, but don't worry. What I'm getting, I'm not telling you because if I get something, then you guys are just gonna find a way to copy me because right now I have the most basic and easy to copy cosmetics. So this is this girl tech everyday casual competitive view map where you have to go all the way across those structures up there in order to make it into competitive lobbies. And Gorilla Tag did something special here in the last couple days and uh, they created a full on giant tube that takes you all the way to Shrek's map. And basically what this is saying is it's saying that this destination is going to change depending on the week. And I think that's going to be really cool to see Gorilla Tag implement a bunch of different map ideas and all of that kind of cool stuff. And here's the exit, by the way. Uh, you go up here. It's a wind tunnel just like to get to clouds because if there wasn't any wind tunnel guys, it would take about a year to get up. I mean, just look at how far down that is. So strange detail, I don't know if you guys noticed this, but in order to, for Gorilla Tag to add this map, they actually had to do a little incision here. They had to cut through this part of the map because it's under this part. And I think it's been way too long since they've used this. I don't think they actually have ever used this in history, but if Gorilla Tag decides to, I think I know what they're going to use it for. The space update, baby. I can't wait for the space update to finally come out. I mean, we've all been waiting so long. But when was the last time a rocket launched on my video? I don't think it's been ever. If this rocket launches on my video, I'm going to be a happy, happy man. But for now, we can just hope and wait. Now for the beef and potatoes of this video. So yesterday when I finished my video, I was walking into forest and I noticed something a little out of the ordinary. It was this giant obnoxious crack with air spilling out of it by the second and it looks like it's starting to get more cracked and I don't know how often it's going to happen. I think every two weeks this crack is going to be getting bigger and once it gets big enough, I think I know what's going to happen. It's going to expand to the point where we can jump down and it'll be a secondary expansion of caves and there'll be mines. Imagine if they actually finally bring mines back. I mean, I've been waiting for mines for a while. They never bring mines back. They just revamped caves. That was it. And it made me very sad because Mines was one of my favorite maps of all time. It was kind of horror-esque. If they do bring Mines back, they're going to release horror mode. So it's a bunch of ideas that fit into one here. Kind of combining a big snowball of, of ideas right here and throwing it right at this ice crack. Also, don't worry, guys. Doug the Bug is not dead. Uh, that was just a troll by, I don't know, one of the team members who made that map. Well, that wasn't very funny, okay? That was sad. Doug the Bug's one of my favorite bugs, so. Also, I don't know why I'm always going in awkward positions to end the video. I'm currently under the slide and you guys are just looking at me. I like this new mouth movement. I said I didn't in the last video, but I like how you can see how fast I'm talking and I'm talking extremely fast. So uh, I hope you all did enjoy this news update video. I hope you learned something new about it. That's just a theory, a gorilla tag theory. And uh, I will see you all in the next one. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. And as always, I will see you all later.